churchgoers ready to party in only one small hospital to help those who have taken things too far. That's the case every summer at Quincy Valley Medical Center, the hospital closest to the popular Gorge Amphitheater. Now it's looking for help from lawmakers. KXOI Forest Grace Distler working for you with more on a bill that would help the hospital financially, but why community leaders say it might not be needed. The town of Quincy, Washington has a little bit more than 7,000 people here, but during an average concert at the nearby Gorge Amphitheater, those numbers can grow by tens of thousands. And when all those partiers overdo it, that puts a strain on the local hospital. On a normal day, even if it's a weekend, we staff one RN and one aide. The three-room emergency room at Quincy Valley Medical Center looks empty today, but six months from now, this place will be bursting at the seams with people who headed to the Gorge and ended up here. So it may be somebody comes in whose blood alcohol level is 400, which is five times the legal limit, and they're intubated because they can't breathe. And then in the next room, they may, there may be someone with a fracture who needs their bone manipulated. After a 21-year-old died from overdosing at the Paradiso Music Festival in 2013, hospital administration decided to take action. It's really, I think, uh, what compelled us and forced us to start looking at the big picture here. In 2013 alone, the hospital racked up $400,000 in unpaid medical bills and extra costs from staffing and supplies. But it's really adding to a situation that's already, you know, a, a challenging situation. State Representative Matt Manweller created a bill to add a surcharge of up to $1 to all concert tickets. That money would be split between the hospital and the local fire station. The hospital thought the Grant County Commissioners were on board with the bill, but to their surprise, learned last week they weren't. We we felt like you know not only the the county was on board, but the county wanted this. In an email, commissioners wrote that the bill isn't needed because it is being addressed on a local level, and said that in 2014 the hospital's debt issues improved. But the hospital still insists this bill is needed to help them during concert season. The fact remains, we still have debt and we still have unpaid expenses, and uh, we feel that you know that needs to be addressed. The the hospital says if this bill does not pass, they'll keep working locally to make sure they get the resources they need. Reporting in Quincy, I'm Grace Stitzler, KXLY 4 News.